yellow. Don't worry. I don't have jaundice. I am at my sister's. So you're going to have to forgive the lighting because my this is my niece's old bedroom and it's yellow. There's one wall that is black. Well, it might be navy because the curtains are navy. But then the other three walls are yellow. So it's just like, Ugh! and this is the only way I can film without too much noise. So I have some awesome, awesome, awesome things to share with you today. These are from Spanny Deals. I hope I'm saying that right. But um, we're going to start with the diamond painting canvas because it is mind blowing. You know, when you see a picture on the website, you're like, oh, that would be such a cool diamond painting. And then you're just hope and pray that it looks just like the picture. Well, this is one of those instances. There we go. Isn't it amazing? Absolutely stunning. The peppermints and the nuts. Oh my gosh. I am in love. And my sister's already like eyeing it, so I gotta be careful because she loves nutcrackers also. So this is a 24 color painting. The um, DMC numbers are on the canvas, which is fabulous. And you can see how clear that canvas is. It's absolutely beautiful. So I think I'm gonna have to start working on this one. Um, right away. So let's see. I don't know how it's going to work. I may not be able to show you the colors in this lighting. It may be too glary since I'm already like day glow skin. All right. So let's see if we can get through this. Oh, I got to get it just right. There we go. Okay. So we have a periwinkle blue and a pale pink. And then we have two bags of 310. Then we have gray, red, and a light blue. Looks purple there, but it is light blue. And then we have bright purple, lavender, and then a buttery yellow color. Then we have very pale gray, which looks blue. It is gray. And then we have brown and bright blue. This lighting is really bad. <gasps> I apologize. I'm so sorry. But I wanted to get videos up. I didn't want y'all to not have video until I get home in February. So suffer through it with me. I hope you will. No hate. So we have blue and kind of a mustardy yellow and brown. And then we have a navy blue. Oh my gosh, that looks green. Maybe it is green. What, what number is that? 16 is, oh, I laid the canvas down upside down. Um, 890, so maybe that is like a hunter green. So we have hunter green, brown and burgundy and then this is kind of a taupe then we have green and lighter burgundy and blue and then here we have a really pretty purple and a very pale blue so that wasn't too painful right but I am so excited about this diamond painting. It is going to be gorgeous. Once you get all the sparkle on there. So, this is the first time I'm talking to you in the new year. So I hope you all had a fabulous holiday. And I really hope that 2021 is good to you. We, um have already gotten some really bad news yesterday. My uncle passed away after a battle with mesothelioma. 
of all things. Um, so this week's going to be kind of rough saying goodbye to him. But on the upside, um, I am glad that we are already here. So we don't have to like drop everything and scramble and rush up here. So we um, will be able to be here for my aunt and cousins to say goodbye to him. So anyway, before I start crying, this next thing is super cool and of course it's completely relevant right now which um is why i went ahead and got them i'm not entirely sure how this is going to work um because they're not going to be washable so this i may um i haven't really given it a whole lot of thought yet but they are face masks with a diamond painting motif peek through the eyes so that make sure there's not glare on there for you but uh, i thought that was a really cool idea and they are the um the pretty thick neoprene fabric so you can see it's nice and i mean it's a nice quality they're really i have some of these um that i purchased because i liked them i actually found them at five below um and i thought well this is this might be better than the cotton, maybe not as permeable, but I haven't tried them on yet. So I know they're going to be big because they're always big on my face, but I twist the earpiece and it makes it a little bit tighter. Ugh. I just washed my hair, so. I'm letting it dry before I do anything to it. So it's always so obnoxious. All right, so there it is. So it fits pretty well. But the only, this is what worries me because I don't know how I wash it. Maybe I will just spray it down with Lysol and let it degas for a few days. I don't know, but I thought it was super cool. And it's another way to be an individual, you know, having to wear masks. At least, you know, it'll be something that not everybody has and maybe a conversation starter. Um, so, yeah. So, this only has three stones on it. They're, um... Oh, yeah. I was like, I'm only seeing two. So, there is yellow and then the blue and just the crystal. So I thought that was a really cool idea. So you, of course, get the mask and the jet, the rhinestones, and then you also get your standard kit with it, just like with every other diamond painting. And I actually got two of them. Since I won't be able to wash them, at least I can, like, because I, I have several other masks, so I figure I could wear one, spray it, let it sit for a couple days, wear the other one, spray it. So at least I'll have, you know, I can switch them up while the other is decontaminating. I don't know. I don't even know if that's going to work. But that's that's my thought process. <laughs> You're going to share that part with you at least. So this next one is a beautiful bee. There we go. Beautiful bee. So pretty. And this one, I think, has four. Yeah, this one has four stones. Mm. Oh no, it's the dreaded teeny tiny um, teardrops. So we have the orange. Oh, come on. The orange baby teardrops that are so hard to work with and then we have crystal yellow and black for this one so i will um i'll post them on facebook when i get done with them and if i remember on my next video i will show you because i am going to work on these immediately um just because i'm so anxious to see them so like I said, these are from 
um, Spenny Deals. I hope I'm saying that right. They're, the link is in the description box, so make sure you check them out. They've got some really cool stuff. Beautiful, beautiful canvases. So um, go check them out. But I wanted to show you, I've actually been done painting while I'm here. Because, of course, I had to bring, I brought my crochet and I brought my diamond painting. Couldn't bring my resin with me because it's way too cold up here for the resin. Plus, there is nowhere for me to sit them safely to cure um, because my sister does have a cat. So, I don't have my normal bathroom where I can, like, shut the door and nobody goes in there for a couple hours. So, this is one that I completed. You saw this in a previous video. And let me see if I can get it to sparkle without blinding you. Look at the color on that. It is so, so pretty in person. I love the red and the gold with a little touch of pink and the pearls on the corner there. Really, really happy with this one. Really like it. And then this one, if you are on Facebook already, you saw that I started working on this and I put the wrong, started putting the wrong stones on her. So I started picking them off and then I realized it was way too much work. So her hair and the blue AB pearls that are in the bottom of her wings and this design in her wings are the wrong stones. But I like it because I like her hair is supposed to be the same goldish yellow. I like that her hair is different from the decorations. And the sparklers that I replaced the crystals with is supposed to all be down here. But I like how, I like my mistake. We'll just leave it at that. And she is stunning. Absolutely beautiful. I think I want to change her shoe to purple. Or maybe, maybe sparklers even. I don't really like the yellow sticking out of her gown like that. It bothers me. But she is gorgeous. I love her. So those are two that I have completed. I've completed a ton of small crochet projects, um, like ornaments and stuff. It's so much easier to work on little projects when you're sitting on a couch with two other people. <laughs> you can't very well work on a king-size blanket with two people beside you. So I've gotten a lot of little stuff done. And then this diamond painting showed up and I'm not exactly sure where it came from. I have been scouring my emails. Um, I want to say it's Amazon, but I'm not entirely sure because of course the packages don't tell you where they're from, but I wanted to share this and get this up there. Oh, excuse me. Mm. This is an awesome awesome painting. Isn't that cool? So this has the DMC codes on the canvas also. And you can see the canvas is nice and clear and crisp. <clears throat> and this is just the PJ packaging. So let's take a look. There's a really awesome corally color. I don't see any red. Interesting. There's some really interesting colors in this one. Okay, so remember this is an eagle with a flag. So we have two shades of purple. I just noticed that. That is huge. Isn't that lovely? I, I, I call those mask zits. Because yeah, you know your face gets all sweaty when you're in a mask. It's got to be what that's from. Anyway. All right. So there we have two browns, black, and gray. Blue and purple and yellow and gray. We have a beautiful deep purple, a lighter purple, light gray, and yellow. Sorry for the terrible angle. Oh, it's, oh, it's bad. 
definitely not liking this camera angle. All right, so then we have white mustard, two purples. Why is there so much purple? It's so strange. And then there is that coral color. And then two more purples and another kind of a mustardy brown color. It's very interesting. I don't know. I'm really confused. So we'll have to see how this turns out. Maybe I'll put rhinestones on the flag stripes. That would be cool, wouldn't it? And use sparklers for that lightning. I'll have to see if I have enough leftovers from my um, paintings I brought with me to complete that. That would be cool. Very cool. All right. So I am going to leave you with that today. And hopefully, I had um, some PR packages sent here. So I'm hoping that now that the holiday is done, that they will start showing up. I think there's three that I have coming here. Um, so I can't promise that there will be two videos this week. But... Um, I hope that you will go back and watch some of my older videos. If you're brand new, I would love for you to go watch, um, you know, previous videos. And that's about it. Thank you so much for hanging out with me and suffering through this bright, bright light. And I will see you very soon.